Hello, San Rosa Christian Church. It's Pastor Steve here, and it's, what, March 18th. It's Wednesday. It's the first day of our county-ordered shelter-in-place mandate that's come down uh, for all of us. And I want to let you know that for myself and the entire ministry staff here at San Rosa Christian Church, we're thinking about you. We're praying for you. And we know that even though we, we can no longer gather on a Sunday morning or even in small groups or in ministry teams, there's still a way for us to stay connected. That even though we can't congregate together, we can still function and be a community together. So I wanna just take this moment to let you know just briefly ways that we're purposing to do that. So Sunday morning at 10 o'clock, I'll be here and we're gonna be doing a live um, feed, video feed that's gonna be available for you. The details of that video feed will be coming in an email today from Glenn so you know how to connect with that, whether it be through Facebook or whether it be through YouTube. And then what we're encouraging is that for small groups following that message is that you'll connect via Zoom and be able to fellowship together, sharing about what you think you heard the Lord say as we looked into the Word on Sundays. You'll be able to pray together, talk about your needs, and be able to also meet in that context, in the context of Zoom, not just on Sunday mornings, but also in your regular um, life group times, whether they be Wednesdays or Tuesdays or Mondays, whatever that happens to be, that we're going to end up having to be a church that meets in your living room. We're a church online now, at least for the next few weeks, that again, we can't gather together physically, but we can be together relationally, and we're going to do that online. So let me encourage you, please, stay connected. Let me encourage you to call up somebody that that you know that's part of the church family. It might be part of your small group, but it might not be. But as the Lord puts them on your heart, call them, stay connected. We're going to want to be available. So if you want to contact me, email me at steve at srchristianchurch.org or Glenn or Noah, any of us. Use our first name at srchristianchurch.org. We'll be able to hear whether it be prayer requests or concerns or questions you might have. Send them to us, and we'll be able to respond to you over these next couple of weeks, again, when we cannot be together. So this is an opportunity. It's an opportunity for us just not to talk and study and congregate together physically as a congregation or community, but actually be a community by caring for one another. Hey, we love you. We're thinking about you. We're praying for you. We're asking God to provide health and safety and peace and also to really use this time. What a unique opportunity for us to be together as family, seeking the Lord, allowing Him to speak to us. We've had a theme of spiritual disciplines. Press into those things. Be in His Word. Be praying. Be praying with one another on the phone or video conferencing. And let's care for one another and let's be amazed because I know that we will be in all that God's really doing. If we're done on April 7th, like they're saying, awesome. That means Easter Sunday, we're going to have an incredible celebration, not just celebrating the resurrection of Jesus Christ, but we're going to be celebrating being together as his people and watching the life of Christ be made manifest as we worship together. So I hope that, again, in these days, you're safe. You're finding the Lord. You're strengthening yourself and encouraging one another. I know God has a lot for us, and I'm standing with you in that along with the entire SRCC ministry team. Hey, we love you. We're praying for you. Amen.